Since beginning my show, I have gotten to talk to some of the world's leading experts on UFOs and aliens. Truth be told, that was one of my goals for starting a show, getting access. Access to experts, access to researchers, access to people that know a lot more about this than me. And many wonder, having studied this thing for so long and having access to some of the world's leading experts on it, what's the bottom line? Trillion dollars in transactions. What do I think, having spent so much time studying this thing? The truth is, I'm unconvinced. Does the government really know about UFOs being advanced alien spacecraft visiting Earth? And they're just covering it up? Does the government have crashed flying saucers? Does the government have alien bodies on some secret base somewhere that they're studying? Are they back engineering alien spacecraft to create advanced weapon systems? Two words, Mr. President. Plausible deniability. I remain unconvinced. Rising moon and Venus. This was taken not at the time of the Hillsdale sighting. It was sure. Several days earlier, not the rich, the, moon, but the powerful, the, morning, the ruling class, Michigan, they have their secrets. But the real secret that they're hiding is they have access to technology decades ahead of the public. And this is the source of a great deal of UFOs. Things that people can't explain and suddenly believe are alien spacecraft. They're not alien, folks. They are the technology of the elite. They are the technology of the ruling class. When people Witness or film a craft flying in the sky, performing incredible maneuvers that no airplane could recreate. This doesn't mean it's alien, friends. It means it's that technology. That technology that comes from a dark playground that few get to play in. It's in that dark playground that these incredible flying devices are designed, created, and tested. Again, a dark playground that few get to play in. It's in that dark playground that trillions of dollars disappear into every single year. With no accountability, no oversight. The dark playground is the source of most UFO sightings that cannot be easily explained. They have unmanned drones with exotic propulsion systems that don't even need a pilot. I, for one, want to see some of the toys inside that dark playground. And build an exotic craft with an energy source that can revolutionize the world. Visible boundary that seems to confine us forcing us to make the same mistakes over and over again. So, my friends, I've developed this thing that I call the Dark Playground Hypothesis. And this truly does explain a great deal of so-called UFO sightings. I believe that the rich, the powerful, the ruling class, the kind of people that could just steal trillions and trillions of dollars from the United States Treasury every year have cram that are decades, if not even perhaps hundreds of years ahead of anything the public has seen. I believe they have some exotic profession systems that the general public certainly does not have any information or access to. 